Hi guys, you know it's me Nick. About to go talk to um, my favorite professor ever, Dr. Moreira. Yeah, she's from Brazil. Hello guys, it's Nick again, and I'm here with Dr. Moreira from the communication um, department. I always tell all my friends that I have the coolest professor here at school, you know. What class has been your favorite over the, this four-year period? Last semester, I think we had a good thing going on in social media. Um, I think it was a good environment. I think we had fun. We talked about serious stuff. You know how much I enjoy teaching monsters in pop culture. Yeah, that's my favorite. That was my favorite. Like, watching scary movies, like, you didn't realize the messages that they were putting in the movies. And, like, she made us all woke. And it was like, thank you, thank you. You've taught at many different universities. Mm -hmm. What would you say is most unique about this university? Graceland is the only place where I've been allowed to actually develop relationships with my students. And I think there is something about, again, the GU culture, right? That, you know, it's like it really goes beyond the classroom. Again, that's what allows me to notice your growth, for mm -hmm. instance, right? He's so a mature man now. See, <laughs> he's ready. We, we try, he's ready to take on the world now. She allows, like, it's a safe space. It's like, there's no, one thing she always says is there's no judgment in here. So, like, if this is how you feel, let it be known. And, you know, we don't, we don't like you any worse or like you any more for it. That's, that's how I think life should be, you know. Yeah. That's how you learn, too. You can force learning, especially when we're talking about deeply held values. Yeah. I want to make sure you are not just productive members of society, but that you're like leaving Graceland like better people. When I think about you, I think of somebody who is like at the best of you. It's like you are kind of like you're like a rebel in like a a cool way, you know you're cool and all that, and look at his face. And I think at best it's like it makes you like original, and you've always been like that. Your take on papers are always very unique. Yeah. What would you tell freshman Nicholas sitting here, and what would you tell senior Nicholas when he's about to leave? Freshman Nicholas would be, <laughs> put your phone away, Nicholas. <laughs> but also, I think I understand freshman Nicholas more now that I know senior Nicholas. Really like the most obvious transformation for me was like the second semester of your junior year. Suddenly it was like, oh, mm -hmm. Nicholas is growing up. That's, that's part of the good thing about coming here is that like teachers will like know you and like definitely know you from mm -hmm. freshman year all the way to senior year. I've seen changes in her too because like first when I first came and I had her classes like she was real serious all the time you know like straight to the point but now you know she's kind of mellowed down a little <laughs> well, thank you guys for tuning in, and thank you, Miss Raquel, for your time again. Yeah. You know, is hope that how to we're do doing? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we can do it again. Well, we can dap it up, right? Can we? No, no, no. Oh, we can do Just. That oh, that was a good one. Ready again? <laughs> <laughs>